Hey there, beautiful creatures. It's Kayla. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi. I'm Kayla. I am medicated, caffeinated, and enlightened. And today, I'm going to be playing with some makeup. I've got a new blush to try. I got this new eyeshadow palette that we're going to be playing with. Yes, I picked up from TJ Maxx the Clueless and Makeup Revolution collab. Their little Dion palette looks like a cell phone. It's so fucking cute. And this color story, look at it. Isn't it beautiful? We're going to play with all the colors, I think. I'm just going to slap it on my face. Speaking of slapping it on my face, let's get started. <laughs> if you are new to my channel, welcome. I don't edit. What you see is what you get, what you guys which clicked on. So you might as well like and subscribe. We love to have fun around here. Oh, man. I'm going to start with primer. My face is clean and ready to go. Um, this is new. I've never tried it before. It's from Give. It's the all-time prime multi-use prep and smooth face oil. Looks like this. It says to use one to two drops. Let's do two. See how far that goes. Oh, it smells good. Mmm. That smells really good. If you're a dry babe, you might need a little couple of more drops. But if you're combo to normal like I am, two will do ya. Oh, oh, feeling gorgeous already. All right, now for foundation, I'm gonna use a CC cream. I'm knocking everything over as well. This is from AOA Studio. It's their color correcting cream. I have mine in the color. I think it says fair there on the bottom. Can you read it? I can't. I don't have my glasses on. I'm gonna give it a little shake here. I'm going to put, let's see, a little here, maybe if it'll come out of the tube, a little across the forehead, a little across the other cheeky, a little on the chin, a little on the nose. I'm going to take a dampened shop misse pawpaw sponge, boop, boop, and I'm going to start... I don't know, kind of swiping and pouncing at the same time. I'm going to swipe up here on the forehead just to get everybody blinded. Get these hairs out of the way. Oh, there's a hair on my sponge. Come on now. <laughs> Uh, this CC cream doesn't have a scent to it at all. Just evens up the skin tone. Feels really lotiony on the skin. Very hydrating. Sponge helps with that as well. Sponge shears it out a little bit. But here's how the complexion's looking. Make sure that line is not there. Alright, let's add a little bit of concealer. We're going to use the e.l.f. What do they call it? Hydrating Camel Concealer Satin Finish in Fair Rose. Put a dollop here, a dollop here, a little on the forehead, nose, chin. And we're going to go back in with that sponge. And just blend it out. Start with the places you want the least amount of coverage and go from there. Mm -hmm. How are you? How you been? How's your day going? Let me know down in the comments. I love talking to you guys. My day's going all right. It's about noon when I'm sitting down to film this on a Monday. Chance of thunderstorms in the area, so everything is a little muggy right now. But I don't mind it. Makes me want to watch Twilight. <laughs> You know what I mean. You know what I mean. If you know, you know. 
All right, now that we got all that blended in, I want to go in with some cream bronzer. This is from Soul Body. Um, it's their Face and Body Bronzing Balm. I have mine in the color Fair. Soul oh, is part of ColourPop. Pop. All right, let's just take the butt of the sponge and I'm going to dip it into here and give it a little swirly swirl, pick up some product. Kind of doing pouncy swipey motions here. Nothing too crazy, nothing too crazy. And this smells super good. It's got like a tropical but not sunscreeny smell to it. I enjoy it. I bought mine when ColourPop was having a 30% off sale. I always wait for a sale. They're always having sales. So I think it was like five dollars. We'll go on the nose with whatever's left over. A little under the lip. Feeling juicy, dewy, gorgeous. Let's put the lids back on. Always remember to put your lids back on. There's rule number one around here. Alright, now for the new blush. I got, if you saw my Walmart beauty box unboxing, I got a blush from AF94 in the color Soft Smile. It's also um, can be used on the lips, so we're going to use it for lipstick today, too. But we're just going to see how this draws onto the face. Get your sponge and we'll tap it out. Ooh, that's pretty. That's real pretty. We don't have AF94 in my Walmarts. Across the bridge of the nose. And we'll wait to put lipstick on. But so far, that is beautiful. Alright, let's set the face just a touch. I'm going to use my Wet n Wild Photo Focus Loose Translucent Powder. I'm going to put some into the cap here. And take a small fluffy brush this one's from wet n wild it's a blush brush it's like my favorite powder brush i need to buy me another one because my other one broke but we're going to put this whether we put concealer it should be the eyes a little on the forehead down the nose Around the middle of the face here, around my mouth, around the smile lines. Just a touch. Get it prepared for shadow because I'm so excited. Oh, we gotta put brows on first. Wait a minute, wait a minute. We gotta put some eyebrows on. We gotta we gotta frame this face. Oh no, I forgot highlight. I forgot highlight a couple of videos ago and I was like, what is wrong with my face? I was like, wait a minute. It needs a highlighter. So let's put a highlighter on. This is the AOA Studio Glow Baby Liquid Highlighter in Morning Glow. This is super pretty. I'm just taking a little bit right here. And we're going to tap it right on the high point of the cheekbone. We're going for subtle today because the eyes are going to be pretty main focused oh, but we love a highlight around here i can't believe i forgot it a couple of videos ago don't know what i was thinking all right there's highlighter okay now let's put some brows on this is the aoa studio slim brow pencil i have it in the color caramel let me grab a mirror so i can see what the hell i'm doing because <laughs> i can't without my glasses so five time magnification here we come all right brows on 
Oh, let me roll it up just a little. Just feathering it through the front a little, adding a little bit of an arch to it, and just fixing that tail. Oh, there we go. All right, let's do this side. I like to start on the bottom to frame it out real quick, and then go back in and fix that arch, get that tail going. Of it through the front. Just like that. And then take your spoolie end and just fluff the front because we want a smooth transition from skin to brow. It just doesn't need to be brow. I mean, if you want it to be brow, be brow, girl. But I want it just this little softer, little, little softer. And then I'm just combing the other brow hairs into place. Like so, like that. Oops, wrong way. Twist that back down. Grab the lid. Oh, don't drop it. Don't drop it. Careful, SpongeBob. Careful. Go ahead and put a lip on while we're here. What do you say? I'm going to use an AOA Studio Wonder Lip Liner in the color Likes. This is new. It's like this really pretty pinky mauve color. I thought it would go good with the blush. Just going to line my lips. Overline the top lip. Like so, like that. All right, now let's put this blush on as the lip because it says it's lip and cheek. I'm just going to go straight from the oh, this is pretty on the lip. I like that. Beautiful. Okay. Now let's move on to this eyeshadow palette. Oh, I'm so excited. We're gonna take a fluffy brush. Let me see which one I want. This one here, this one is from Wet n Wild and we're gonna dip into the color Polyester Hair, which is the lightest matte in this palette. This is gonna go pretty much all over the lid and up into the crease. This is gonna be our first transition color. Let me grab the mirror. <laughs> <laughs> do you have this palette makeup revolution is kind of you know not killing it but the last couple of things i bought from makeup revolution have been bangers so i'm kind of intrigued Yes, just putting this all over the crease, up to the brow bone, all over the lid. This is going to be our transition shade. A little on the lower lash line to get us started. Just on that outer corner. Alright, now we're going to dip into the color jeepin it's the brown the deep brown in there same brush just swirling my brush in there i'm going to tap this off though and this is going to sit right about here this is our deepening crease shade i have hooded eyes so i go just a little bit above my crease and then into the crease Like so, like that. A little bit on the other side. A 
I'm just setting and wiggling, letting the brush do the work. Like so, like that. Subtle but pretty. Taking a little bit of that same color and we're going to put it on the lower lash line in that outer third where we did that first color. All right. Now let's dip into um, the color Buyer's Remorse. It's the matte tealy green color in here. I'm going to take a small pencil brush. This one's from e.l.f. I'm going to load it up. Tap it off. And this is going to go really close to that lower lash line. Right on that outer third. Just like that. Just a hint of color. Because we're going to take the color Woman on the same brush, which is the shimmery green color in the palette here. Going to load it up. And this is going to go on the inner third here. Blend it a little bit with that outer edge just to keep everybody cohesive. <laughs> I'm loving this. All right. All right, now for the Shim Shim. I'm going to take this little flat brush right here in the color. We're going to start with the color Picky, the gold in the middle there. Let's see how this picks up on a brush. May need to grab some setting spray. Let's do that. Um, let's grab this one. Oh, if I can reach it. Oh, got it. This one's from Toyco, but anyone will do. Give that a little spritz, and this is going to go on the outer third, because we're going to go in with that brighter gold on the inner portion. This color is so pretty, look at that. I want it all the way to this outer corner. Just slowly blend in the edge. All right, let's put some on the other side. This color is so fucking pretty. Look at that. Just loading it up. We're going to spray it. I feel so pretty. Pick up just a little bit more. I'm not going to spray it this time. I'm just going to pick it up and tap it off. There we go. Oh, it's what I wanted, darling.
All right. Mm. Feeling gorgeous and glamorous and very down. All right, with the same side of that brush, I'm going to dip into the color Miss Dion, the bright, bright gold in here. Just going to see if I can pick this shadow up. Oh, it is flaky as hell. I'm going to spray it, give it a fighting chance, and this is going to go in the inner corner. Oh, like liquid fucking gold. It's a little chunky, but that's okay. We're going to work with it. That's why we sprayed the brush. Just going to slowly blend this into the crease and back into that bronze color. Like so like that. <laughs> so, oh, oh, look at that gold shim shim. Beautiful. Okay. Pick you up some more. like gold leaf it is so pretty can you see what I'm seeing do you see this this was two dollars from TJ Maxx I'm not sure if this palette is still available on clearance on the makeup revolution website but I would check because this is fucking amazing add a little mascara my loves and we're done I'm gonna use the Maybelline sky high lash sensational I got a little mini one here. Let's just load these bad boys up. Doodly doo. Oh, I forgot my theme song. Doodly doo. I'm sorry. Doodly doo. Doodly doo. Doodly 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 doo. Doodly 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 doo. Put on the lower lashes. Oh, I feel so pretty. This is exactly what I wanted to look like today, and I love it. Oh, don't poke yourself in the eye. Damn it. Yeah! Okay, my loves, my coven, my beautiful creatures. This is where I'm going to leave you. Stunning as usual. Okay. You are my coven and my people, and I love you, and I will see y'all in my next one.